is one go. Yeah, do it in one go. One go with this, so let's make it count. I have my first Star Fortress. I should actually... Uh... And on I guess if I could tell how strong the automated Dreadnought is. Very strong. Yeah, like stronger than my 3-something K fleet that I'm so yeah. proud of. It's, it's going to be something like 30k. Yeah, you're, you're not going to be going for that anytime soon, I guarantee it. Oh, well, I mean, I could. It just well, wouldn't work, succeed. and I'd lose all my yeah. fleets. <laughs> yes, you're not going to succeed. So don't tell me what I can and can't do. You're not boss me. All right, let's see. This might be the final big battle. Construction complete. Oh, they were foolish enough to come away from their starbase. I send an army of my turtle pop after them. Oh, they're melting as if they were made of butter. Mm, they're melting butter. us with science. No, don't fight towards the starbase, you fools! Leaders are dying. Admiral, my admiral died. Oh man, I actually finally need you. <laughs> That's kind of kind of that is rather annoying when they do that. Yeah. Like, why can't they be immortal? Uh, I will mention that the uh, um, governors you can get from the uh. <laughs> I don't know about the, the scientists, but the governors you can get from the trade outposts, they're immortal. Hmm. Oh, neat. This seems like an excellent time to research habitability, because I'm sending a bunch of turtles to planets that they only kind of sort of can deal with. Like <laughs> 65%. Huh. I have a, uh, a star base into the space behind the uh, Ganlarev Marauders. Guess I know where I'm going to expand to. I have a clone, clone Terrapin army, but it's not as good as an army of cloned mole penguins. <laughs> so what will I get here? Sinistra... So I decided to upgrade one of my uh, star bases because I noticed that I had some piracy risk, and pirates decided to spawn. Because they're rude. It's like they knew what was coming. Yeah. I should check my piracy risk. I haven't, I haven't come up much. Because I got it kind of on lockdown. For the moment. Now, do I get a bonus to my armies if I have somebody in orbit when uh, I'm attacking? I'm not really sure. I haven't. I, I've found that the best way to handle uh, occupying occupying planets is to just overwhelm them with numbers. Just just toss, throw numbers at them. Really is the best. Complete. Way to do it. Fair enough. For example, seven. <laughs> Throw the number seven at them. No panic. About three years away from Federation. Well, not Federation, but diplomacy stuff. We were talking while you were rebooting at one point, Zerf. I guess I'm gonna, like, uh, try, speed track towards Federation just so that we can have an automated, uh, you know, backing each other up posture. Ah. Uh. And it's got it's got benefits. Like going into that tree will give me some economic benefits eventually. I don't get anything for being the one who gives us Federation first, but we kind of need it. Especially with the Madari Star Assembly dragging us into Lost Wars. <laughs> All right. Unfortunately, I did lose uh, the planet of Nucleus. It. Uh... How did they get this fleet out of nowhere? Like, 
I'm occupying all their stuff, and somehow they suddenly have a fleet of 500. Oh, it's their buddies uh, coming in. Oh, yeah, the Shazarak. I forgot you ended your war with them. Yeah. Oh, the Shazarak were... They, uh... They weren't too tough, and that's why I'm losing this war. Because now they're in it, and they're like, "Hey guys, you don't need to worry about not." <laughs> Sorry. Don't <laughs> give up. Well, you've occupied all their systems. Oh, but you still have, you have to land people on other planets. Well, and I can't really this. get to them to attack the other place. Uh, you should be able to go. I mean, it would be not fast, but you could go through the Midari and then me. Yeah, the problem is, is that they can just go right through. Yeah, they, they've got open borders of the Beldross, I'm sure. Well, you should go repair. Yeah, if you got, if you got money. No, I, I don't have that much money. Special project <laughs> complete. Oh no, I had one that was redded out, but it was it was redded out because I don't have that tech yet. That's why. I... Hmm. I am spending all my money on this. It's probably not that smart. So you guys go here. Ships upgraded. Oh man, another commerce exchange thing. Prayer's complete. Okay, so you guys go way over here. I got them tied now. I have more. So if I have my transport fleet is up over them by about a hundred, is that going to be enough, or are they still going to have a chance of winning that? They're still going to have a chance. Um, you could put a guy in charge um general yeah general it might be oh yeah i meant to do that might help. i never really bother with that but yeah no i don't here. i don't Army i don't damage. find them yeah, yeah. worthwhile uh in general but oh. if it's that close see again i usually go with like um i, I was sending t a thousand against uh, planets defended by 500 so i don't i don't mind if they die and especially once you get cloning tech who cares? Yeah, it just makes me clones. Right. And they're fast and cheap to build, so. I got two more transport fleets on their way here, so I might as well let them get into that. And then once they help. do, I got a little bit of time. I'm winning the attrition now, just barely. And once I take over their home base, I'm sure that will. Hey, I got a new branch of us. Yeah. Hey, I've been ignoring noticed, all my home planets. Oh, I noticed one of your planets, <laughs> uh, it, it was going to be generating 13 uh, um, energy credits for me, so I was like, yeah, it's probably worthwhile. And it's pretty close to getting to the... Nope, that's not the right world. Where is it? Yeah, it's pretty close to getting to uh, 25 pops, which is when I can build a second building, so... Hey, I can find a clear one of these guys. Conquer claim. Alright, here goes my armies. Oh, it actually shows them going to the planet. Yep. Planetary Unless you zoom in too far, then they disappear off the map. You are about to face the full might of the Madari Assembly, human. 
You mean the pathetic might? <laughs> <laughs> Officially? Alright, uh, naval capacity. Not right this second. Hmm, I wonder why the Midari might have broke, broken their migration treaty with you. I can't imagine why they would have done that. I already got some of their pops, it's fine. <laughs> I, got, I can grow my own now in my clone labs. Oh, so this is interesting. Now it's just frontline versus frontline, and then your recruits have to step up, eh? Yeah. That's a much more interesting... Uh... Yeah, it is. It's pretty cool. I, li I do, uh, do really like it. And then depending on the size of the planet, they have larger combat widths. Mm-hmm. Well, now, they've got... No, uh... Now, when they have disengaged, how come mine don't disengage? Bunch of jerks. Um, there's just a chance for them to disengage each time. No, they got a huge chance for theirs, because they've all been disengaging. Research complete. However, I don't think they're going to recover fast enough for me to have not taken them over. Oh no, two of them popped all back right. in. I am attacking the system. It's pretty awesome. Everybody check out the big space battle. Oh, you start attacking the disengaged ones once it gets low enough. Uh, yeah, once once you overflow their lines and you, you attack their... Uh, which is one of the reasons why it's great. pretty great. You got 5k? I'm only at 3.9k. Wow. Who, me? Yeah, how many how many alloys are you producing each month? Twenty-one. I'm Dang, buying a lot. I'm, I'm, oh, you're I'm buying. Se okay. I sell a lot of stuff, okay. and I didn't lose any in the previous war. That okay. is true. Research complete. That's a fair point. <laughs> so <laughs> I took sounds. over. I won this. I won this thing, right? Yeah. And here's my question to you. I won this thing, and then somehow they got a big boost to freaking attrition and stuff. I mean, if the number went up, yeah, that's the way it should go. I mean, no, they got a, they got, I, my attrition went up more than theirs. Oh, because you lost, so they don't lose, the, and the, this is a complaint that I have, they don't gain uh, attrition or war exhaustion from losing defensive armies, you lose, you gain some for losing attacking armies. Well, this is BS. It is. It, it really is. Because I'm going to have to say this, because if I go to 100% war exhaustion, I'm just going to give up, right? Uh, no. Um, then they they can force peace, but it would still be a status quo. Oh, and you would keep the things that you, you've you got occupied. Well, I'm taking, um, according to this, I'm taking uh, my three prime now. So I should just try yeah. to occupy the other ones real quickly if I can, I guess. Eh? Yeah, go, go occupy botch. <laughs> Debris analyzed. About to take over this world, it looks like. I got more. Uh, uh -oh. oh, never mind. I made it in time. All right, two to one fleet advantage. Uh oh, for me, but they got troops coming in. We have successfully invaded Wandering Nest. Check it out, folks. Lots of flashing lights. Computer uh, ships have to be ramming into each other this range. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and they fled. Oh, I forgot to give. My, I forgot to assign an admiral to my fleet. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> well, yeah, but you are missing out on the. Uh... I'm not getting any experience out of it. Ah, yeah. oh, crap! I'm not there. Right, final. Get a stupid hollow for crew one. Where are my other planets suffering from that? Not really. I hate I building hall of right. Sorry, I just had like eight things pop up at once. Uh, one of them some simple construction thing, fine. Then some stuff, and then another... Okay, it wasn't as big a thing as I thought. And the timed project is just uh, debris, so cool. Yeah, sorry, I kind of had a moment of That's like, fine. what? And then I was like, oh. That's fine.
Admiral Gaines Trace. Come on, you stupid ships, fly faster! <laughs> There's tech for that. What is this housing issue? No building slots available, overpopulation. Twenty K, that's expensive. Let's get this kind of appliance going instead. Twenty yeah. K for what? Oh, it would have given me twenty percent increase in science from scientists. But it's like, ooh, 20,000. That's like three times as expensive as any of the texts that would actually begun. give me something I don't have rather than even. Oh, yeah. All right, we're invading. Ah, they have no back line this time. Actually, they didn't even have seven armies, so. What's this? Seven armies. I work exhaustion. Oh, no. Hurry up. Incoming transmission. Debris analyzed. Decline. They can't sue us, start, stop us yet. We just gotta win this one invasion. And it's gonna be done quick. Yeah. Gotta win it for the giver. Yep. Two armies left. There we go. Disengaged one. I'm watching the uh, fight because I got a corporate banter office. There you go. There we go. So now Total we victory. come in here. Achieve war goals. Achieve war goal. How much leaders have gained level? Send offer. Let's see what happens. End of the Mathens Star Nation. There we go. Destroyed by its enemies. So apparently, Just like they deserve. I control both of the uh, um, the wormholes into relatively uh, inaccessible space. I like this. <laughs> Debris analyzed. Oh man, and you have no idea how much research things I have going on. Nope, hopefully your video records so I can check it out later. <laughs> <laughs> well, I Sorry. just, they gave me an awful lot of uh, spots to send ships oh, to. Killing transport fleets in space, it's just so... Fun? Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of evil. Yeah, but I mean, it makes sense. It does. Can I upgrade this? Debris nope. analyzed. Let's learn diplomacy traditions so that I can be friends with my neighbors when I'm not taking them over. And hopefully it reduces the amount of uh, influence that's being spent. Be nice. Who do I have a non-aggression pack with? Oh man, all these scientists suck because my scientists that were good at discovering things died. Research complete. I might have to swap out some of these research scientists, but then get them some on the field for a while. Oh, I have a non-aggression pact with the Midari. Um, I'm gonna break that. <laughs> I need, I need that influence. Sorry, sorry, buddies. I'll take the commercial pact though. Any other planets that don't suck me, Dari? Oh, hey, Zerf, how you, how you doing? Welcome to the system that I'm taking over. Oh, yeah, I guess I don't need to go up over there anymore. Oh, I see Sirius now has uh, 25 pops. I can build something. What do I want? No. Why, are you, why are you passing through, Zerf? What's up? Oh, that, I was taking the long way to the other guys in case I had to attack them. Now I don't need to. Alright, guess I'm building some uh, video game uh, d 
development studios on Sirius Prime. JG. <laughs> Why so sure. serious? Prime. Why so serious? Indeed. I'm about to take over their capital. That might uh, that might cause them to think differently. Well, then never mind. The capital's one of the worlds I'm claiming, so it's not really going to change that. <laughs> Are you gonna leave the uh, the stuff to the south for uh, Zerf? Yeah, it depends on how fast he gets around to attacking these guys. <laughs> we have faction founded Alliance of Spiritual Redemption. Best possible outcome. Okay. So we have peace in our time. Well, and. Uh... That's a pretty good uh, time to end the episode. So we'll come back next time. Complete. We'll see how this uh, affects uh, stuff. Your mm -hmm. empire. <laughs> you yeah, may have also, some slight problems. Just so you know, you might be interested in this. During the war, um, we ended up finding another precursor artifact. We're up to five now. I need to steal them from you or something. That's that, that needs to be a thing. It really needs to be a thing. Well, yeah, because then I can steal one from you and I'd be done. Mm. I have no idea what's making them pop up either, because I had two pop up in a relatively short period of time, and then it's generally it's it's just random. Oh man! Well, as long as you don't have a uh, maximum number, it's just random. I guess there's still a chance. Yeah, yeah, there's still a chance. There's also still a chance I could beat you to it. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Might hope at least. Anyway, see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, everybody. <laughs>